Well, happening today, you are invited to a drive through iftar. It's a meal eaten by Muslims after sunset during Ramadan. The drive through is today from 4 to 5 at the African Youth and Community Organization office in Northeast Portland. And joining us live with more is the organization's program and development manager, Abdirahman Abdirahman. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, what is iftar? So iftar is uh, the meal Muslims eat when they break their fast. It's uh, at sunset. Uh, pretty much we break our fast with dates. It's what our uh, beloved prophet ate when he broke his fast and water, have a small meal, we pray. And then after that, uh, we have like a bigger meal. And, and this is something happening uh, daily in observance of, of Ramadan, correct? So for anyone who's unfamiliar, tell us a little bit about the holiday and what you're observing during Ramadan. Yeah, so Ramadan is uh, the ninth month in the Islamic calendar in which uh, Muslims abstain from eating and drinking from sunup to sundown. Uh, yeah, but it's not only that, it's a spiritual month and uh, most Muslims are always at the mosque, you know, they're giving out the charity and doing a lot of generous work, like what we're doing here at ICO. Uh, yeah. Yeah, when uh, you talk about the importance of Ramadan, uh, uh, it, is, it is a religious holiday, is it not? Yeah, it's a holy month in which uh, the, our holy book was revealed to the Prophet. How, how important is it for you to be able to celebrate as a community and, and to reach out to uh, the Islamic community here in the Portland area? Well, it, it's a, a thing we strive to do every year. I mean, it was kind of tough during the last two years with COVID. We couldn't really have a lot of gatherings. So uh, this one's a big one for us. And uh, how does it feel now to be able to, to gather as a community now that we're through most of the restrictions and uh, you can actually uh, reach out and touch each other. Well, I mean, uh, Islam is all about love. So this is a great opportunity for uh, all the community to come together. And that's why we came on here today to give this a showcase and spread the word. Yeah, and you mentioned this is one of the things this month that ICO has been putting together. Tell us a little bit more about ICO and, and the organization's work. So yeah, ICO began uh, working with immigrant and refugee youth back in 2009 and doing like mentorship, sports activities. And then since, uh, the, since its inception, we uh, started working with families just, uh, of the youth and helping them, you know, uh, navigate through like this tough uh, uh, transition in their life from, you know, moving from East African countries to coming to America. Yeah, how large is the uh, Muslim population here in the Portland metro area? It's about like 20,000, I, uh, I believe. It could be a little bit more. It's been growing a lot. Yeah, and, and events like this certainly uh, help people who are new to the area reach out and connect with that community. So where can people go to, to find out more about today's drive through and, and give us the details real quick about the drive through of TAR happening later? Yeah, so uh, the details are on our website. It's uh, AYCOworld.org. And yeah, we have a calendar there. People can go check it out. Uh, we have contact information. So it'll be today from four to five uh, at our location in Northeast 74th in Gleason. All right, thank you very much. We appreciate uh, you coming and telling us more about this. Abdiraman, thanks for uh, being here this morning. All right, thank you so much. And of course, we'll post this interview along with everything discussed on the AM Extra section of coin.com. Go check it out if you celebrate Ramadan.